DJ Somebody's Wife pens down a beautiful, heartfelt, touching message to his husband as he was laid to rest this weekend. A letter to my heart. I lay here so consumed with heart, heartbreak and pain. I'm overwhelmed with so much emotions because we had so many things we had planned. I'm truly grateful for the time we spent together. 12 years of love, laughter, and pain. I'm so grateful to have been a part of your journey to success. Lifting you up with support. I am proud of the man you are, you were. I am proud of the leader you were in our lives. There's so much I'd like to say, but as I write this, tears run down my face because our house will not be the same without you. No more hearing you yell, baby, all the way from upstairs because you cannot find your clothes. I'm so angry, but I want you to know how much I love you. There are no words to describe it. The pain is so deep. Watching you achieve everything you spoke about when you were broke, lol, is truly a blessing. I don't take any of it for granted. To Sbu, who loved and protected my husband, I want you to know that he loved you dearly as a friend. I appreciate you for being with us. May the heavens accept both of you, both your souls. To my family, I am truly grateful for accepting Oba into our lives and cherishing him. Masfoka, I'm truly thankful for the warmth you still embraced me with. I'm truly grateful for the king you blessed me with. Respect, he had respect, love, and kindness. To the Sefuka family as a whole, Zibu, Kogeto, and Tandi, and the family at large, thank you so much for the love, for your unwavering support. <laughs> She will never speak on top of her husband's cold body.